Something mysterious has just happened in Asorok concerning who to take over Puare. Prophet Apostle Paul Okiki Jesu of the Christ Apostolic Miracle Ministry has said that mysterious things are currently going on in the presidential villa. According to him, Vice President Professor Yemi Osibajo will briefly take over as Nigerian president in a short while in a series of prophecies he forwarded to Daily Post on Saturday. The cleric warned Buari against fomenting trouble. He said, unless the president change his ways, the government will be taken from him and given to someone better. Thus says the Lord of hosts, the president should not foment trouble. He should not allow people to coerce him because some people are pursuing him. Thus says the Lord, the president should humble himself, change and turn to me. He should also honor the anointed men of God else the government will be taken away from him and it will be given to his neighbor who is better than him thus says the lord if the president refuses to follow my instruction the event that may happen that will make people not to hear about him anymore we are called this is what we prompt the government to be given to his vice president. Then, Osibajo will occupy the presidential seat for a brief period of time. Before I will bring the beloved to govern the country for me, thus says the Lord, mysterious event is currently happening in Asorok Villa, and this is the manifestation of I, the Almighty God. Crisis is presently occurring in Asorok that is causing worries. There is no soul that is at ease in Asovila. There is no one that has faith on the survival of his or her soul that has faith, including the president and the vice president together with all the security personnel that work there. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. Crisis is presently occurring in Asorok that is causing worries. Oh, wow. There is no soul that is at ease in Asorok at present. You see, my, view my viewers, the word of God is ye and amen. You don't joke with the word of God. You don't joke with the word of God. Because when God decides, nobody can undecide. When God speaks, nobody can unspeak. Abba. See, let me tell you, this is a warning. It's a warning, you know, and this is it's not only Okiki Jesu that, ha, that, 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 that has just given this warning. This warning has been coming mm -hmm. since the beginning of last year. Someone gave the prophecy that Osibajo is going to take over 
President Momo Buari. I think up to four persons gave that same prophecy last year. And now, this year, Okiki Jesu is now the first saying it again this year. And I believe that some other prophets will still say the same thing. Hmm. Uh, uh, my viewers, the word of God is not what one must joke with. You must not joke with it. At all. It's a warning. It now depends with the president if he will heed or not. If he, if he chooses to remain adamant the way he used to, so be it. If he doesn't want his case to be like that of Yaradwa and uh, Good Luck Jonathan, then he must give himself some atom of respect and do as advised. Because I can see that the president, President Mome Buari, is becoming adamant in all instructions. He has been remaining adamant. Many times, a, a man of God calls him, advises him, look, don't do this. That which they told him not to do is what you will see him doing. Why? Even ordinary um, human beings, like unlike what actually led to the answers pro pro um, protest, do you know that it is the president Momo Bari that 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 made that caused the the that 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 caused the Ensas protest, because if he has not released those soldiers, those people, those uh, guys wouldn't have uh, has attacked him, At uh, wouldn't have um, protested, and um, and they wouldn't have. Um, the, we, we wouldn't have experienced any killing of, of youth. Do you understand? Falano called Bwari to order. He told him, look, man, don't do what you want to do. If you release those soldiers, you get yourself prepared to, to contend with the, with, the, with the ICC. He warned him. He warned him. Yet... He didn't listen. Now, a man of God is speaking to him now. Let's see if he's going to listen. Let's see if he's going to listen. Just like they will say that a word is enough for the wise. If you like, you listen. If you like, you not listen. It's left to him. So, my dear viewers, based on what Okijesu have just said, what do you think? What's your own advice? Please. Deem it free to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive more updates. Thank you.